Hey everyone, welcome to TechWire. In this video, we are going to solve problem number 1011, capacity to ship packages within D-Days. We will see the logic and the code for this problem. Now let's dive into the solution. So here I've taken the second example from the lead code website. So here we are given two inputs. One is weights input array and then the number of days. So basically we need to find the minimum weight capacity of the ship that will enable me to transfer all of these weights within the days that is given. So basically you need to find the minimum capacity that is required to transfer all of these weights within the given days, right? So we are going to solve this problem using binary search, right? So initially I will have the left and right pointers where the left pointer will be the maximum element in my input array that is 4. Then my right pointer will be the sum of all elements in my input array which is nothing but 16 in this case. Now I will find the middle value in this given left and right pointers. So to get my middle value, I will add left and right pointers and divide by 2. So I'm going to get 10 in this case. So 10 is my middle value. Then I'm going to initialize two variables. One is day, another one is total weight. So this will help me to keep track of the days that we are iterating through and total weight will enable me to keep track of the weights that we are adding on each and every day right so now we will start so i will be having two loops one loop will do the binary search and another one will enable me to add the weights and we are going to check that we are not extending the maximum weight right so now i've done the first binary search and I will keep left pointer as 4 and mid value as 10 and right pointer as 16. Now I start adding the weights. So initially I pick the first weight that is 3 and I will add that to my total weight. So it is 3. Then I need to check the total weight whether it's greater than my middle value. It is not greater. So I just keep adding the next weight. Right? So it will become 5. Now I need to again check whether 5 is greater than 10. No. I'll just keep adding the weights. Now it is 7. Now I need to check whether it's greater than middle value. No, it's not. So I will just adding the weights. Now after adding 4, now it's greater than my middle value. So when my total weight is greater than the current middle value, then I will move to the next day. Then I will initialize the current weight that is nothing but the 4. I am still at the first iteration of my binary search. Right. So I'm just keep on adding the weights and moving to the next day in the second loop. Right. So my second loop restarts again. I will move to the next weight and I'll pick that weight and then I will add that to my total weight. Then I will check whether it's greater than my current middle value. It's not. So I'll just keep on adding. Now it becomes 9 after adding 4. Now I, again I need to check. It's not greater. Now after finishing that loop. Now I will compare the original days with the day counter that we are tracking. If the original day is greater than my day counter. That is 2. If 3 is greater than 2. Now I will move my R pointer and point it to the middle value. Now this is my R pointer, right? So basically we are reducing the maximum capacity. So we need to find the least capacity, right? So we are just shrinking the range, the maximum minimum range. And then finally we are going to return the left pointer where my minimum weight capacity of the ship will be occurring. So now I am resetting my day and my total weight which is nothing but 1 and 0 then I'm going to again calculate the middle value so now new left and right pointers are 4 and 10 
now again i'm going to find the middle value by adding left and right pointers and divide by 2 in this case i'm going to get 5 so by adding 4 and 6 and then dividing by 2 i'm going to get 5 so this is my new middle value now again i need to start adding the weights i will add 3 to my total weight now i need to check whether it is greater than my current middle value no it's not greater so i'll just add the next one this 5 now I need, again i need to check whether it's greater than my middle value no it's not greater it's equal so if it is equal i'll just keep adding the next weight so i'm going to add the next weight i'm going to get 7 now the weights are greater my total weight is greater than my middle value so when this happens i move to the next day i'm increasing day by one then i'm pointing it to the current weight my total weight is now the current weight i'm just initializing two here this is my current weight now i will add weights so i will add four to my total weight now it will be six whether it's greater than my middle value yes it is greater i will move to the next day and i will initialize total weight as my current weight that is four right now i will add one to it i will just pick the next weight i will keep adding the weights now it becomes five now again i need to check whether it's greater than my middle value no it's not greater so i just add the next weight to my total weight then i'm going to get nine by adding five to four right now i need to check whether my total weight is greater than my middle value yes it is greater right so i will increase my day then i will initialize my total weight as my current weight which is nothing but four now i'm done with my weights input array now i will compare the day counter that is four and the original days that is three if my day counter is greater than my original days then i will move my left to pointer by adding one to my middle value that is six in this case so my left pointer becomes six then if i keep on doing the same method i will be having my left to pointer pointing to six then left pointer is the minimum weight capacity the ship can transfer all of my weights within the days that is given so finally i will return left pointer now we will see the code before we code if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel please like and subscribe this will motivate me to upload more videos in future and also check out my previous videos and keep supporting guys so initially i'm going to have my left and right pointers so left will be max of my weights right then right pointer will be the sum of all of my values in the weights input array then i will write then while loop until my left pointer is less than my right pointer right Then I'm going to calculate the middle value that is left plus right and divide by 2. Then I'm going to have the day counter where I'm going to initialize with 1. Then I'm going to have the total weight where total weight will be 0 at the start. Then I'm going to write another loop where I'm going to get each and every weights from my weights input then i'm going to keep on adding to my total weights then i'm going to write a if condition if my total weight is greater than my middle value then i'm going to increase my day counter i'm moving to the next day then i'm assigning total weight as the current weight then i'm going to write another if condition where my day counter is greater than my given days in the input original input right if it is greater i will move my left to pointer to the next value of my mid value right then if it is not if my 
day counter is less than my number of days given then I will assign mid value to my right point right then finally I will return the left pointer I think it's fine let's run the code as you guys see it's pretty much efficient the time complexity is log of n and the space is constant space happy learning keep supporting cheers guys